Hi, I'm Rachel, a mom of three kids, Alex, Richie, and Ethan. We decided to leave our home country in the USA to travel the world, starting in Chiang Mai, Thailand. Join us on our fun, crazy, and average everyday lives while we journey around the world. Travel Cat Family. So here's the view out our window. It's not the best view in the world, but it's, you know, it's a view. <laughs> roof from next door. So anyway, it's interesting. My room's a bit of a mess and cluttery. I gotta have the boys clean up. Ethan, clean up your mess, please. Come on. Take up your hat, Richie. Let's get all this stuff clean and put away. Okay? Richie's bed up there is too hot. The fan doesn't reach him, so heat rises, so um, there's no air conditioning in here. He was burning up, so he ended up having to come and lay in my bed with me because the fan here at least reaches a little bit down here. So, anyway, so we're gonna prepare to go have breakfast. We'll go see you guys there. Okay, so we are in a our little breakfast restaurant here, and we got an omelet. And Ethan got Ethan and Richie are sharing some butter toast. He had two pieces of butter toast each. Richie didn't want an egg, so he had his two pieces of butter toast, and I just ordered him some butter butter toast and jam. Isn't it good? It's a pretty good omelet. It was like as big as the whole plate, and it's really good. It was only 22 rupees, which is about, how much is 22? That's way under a dollar. Yeah, about 30 cents um, a plate for food. And then the toast was even cheaper than that. 17 rupees and 15 rupees, so that's like even cheaper than 30 cents, so. We're gonna be doing pretty good here. <laughs> Show you a little bit of the restaurant. It's a nice little restaurant. Yep. So we're pretty happy about the prices. Okay, so here's the butter toast. They're pretty big slices. Pretty good. Richie had about three slices and even we gave him one. So, is that good, honey? Yeah? Okay, now we are walking to try to find a bank. And this is some of the street area. Thought you guys would find it interesting. That's a bus. There's a park over there. There's a park for kids? Yeah, I know. Ooh, we're gonna have to check that out later, huh? So we just checked two ATMs and two banks and there's no way we can withdraw money. So I'm very concerned because I don't mind using my card, but every single time I use my card, my bank in America charges me five US dollars. So if we go out to breakfast and only like spend five bucks for breakfast, I'm also gonna be charged five dollars for that five dollar breakfast from my bank's end. So I'm really concerned. They're having a really big problem with um, money here in India. I had no idea or we wouldn't have um, planned our travels at this time. Every day they're saying that it's gonna work tomorrow, it's gonna work tomorrow. They said we're just gonna have to find an ATM that's gonna work. And so far we have not found an ATM that's gonna work. So I'm very concerned because we're gonna need to save money to have tickets to go to the next place. And if we can't save money to go to the next place, then we're going to overstay our visa. That's going too far ahead, so I'm trying not to think too far ahead, and I'm just trying to think of day-to-day. -day. So first and foremost, we need to find an ATM that we can take money out. Otherwise, we're in big, big trouble. So here we are walking down the street hoping to find an ATM, and everybody is looking for an ATM here. So there's going to be long lines, very long lines. So, let's hope to go off and find an ATM that works. Oh, and they do them that way. There's a foreign exchange place. We don't have money to exchange. We need, we need cash. We still look over there. Okay, let's just go this way, you guys. Some 
sort of boardwalk water area or something like that. Is that cool, you guys? Yeah. <laughs> cool, huh, Ethan? Yeah. Water. Huh? Let's go get some water. Oh yeah, Ethan wants to get some water. Okay you guys, so we never found an ATM that is working and so we're unable to... Oh look at that. Anyway, we were, we were not able to get any money at all so we're kinda, we were kind of like, well... I was standing at one of the ATMs and it was an empty ATM, like no people were around except for maybe like a couple Indian people. And um, I just told the kids, because um, the Indian guy said, oh, it doesn't work, you know? And so I was like, I was like, okay, so I turned at the kids and I said, you know what? I'm not even gonna worry about it because God is gonna make a way and where there seems to be no way he'll open a way for us and he'll, you know, provide for us. And so, you know, the, the kids were just like, yeah, they were agree agreeing with me. And uh, I really just had a peace over me. Like, I didn't even feel worried. I was just like, you know what? God's gonna make a way. He's not gonna, like, let anything happen to us while we're here just because we can't find money. You know, he's gonna provide for us. And I know we have money on our card and everything, but I'm not, I wasn't gonna worry about it. I was like, you know what? I'm not gonna worry about it. Anyway, I'm gonna keep rambling. So long story short, we start walking down the street looking for another ATM and we bump into this American family, American couple. And so we start talking and everything about the ATM situation and everything else like that. And we started talking to them. And um, after talking a little bit, they pulled out 500 rupees or 600 rupees and they handed it to us and they said, here, take this, you know, um, we want to help you because we know it's hard to get money right now. So, uh, and then they said how like in the past in their lives, you know, God came through for them and, and gave to them when they were in need and this and that. And, and I'll just cut it short, but yeah, so I, it was a good example to my children, you know, what I told them moments before that you know what we're not going to worry we're going to have faith and god is going to make a way and so my kids got to see god make that way right before their eyes so i just had to share that with you guys you know okay guys so we are going to go get some water ethan's thirsty actually we probably should just go home and get the water we already have no I right water. and we don't even have any water left yeah we, do. we have one bottle left yeah i have my bottle but now we can buy water bottles because you know the people helped us and stuff so yeah. we could have bought them anyway but it would have charged us like five extra US dollars for every yeah. swipe and I don't I don't feel comfortable necessarily using my card all around the area you know yeah. <laughs> so let's um, go ahead and go find do you guys just want to like find a place to eat there is huge there's huge right there. or what should we do there was a nice looking place it's about there. lunchtime isn't it yeah is that can, a crow we can go back toward our house no yeah. crow you guys ready yeah, to go so find a place to eat? You ready to go find a place to eat? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Okay, so we're here for lunch, and Alex is gonna eat the way they eat here with her hands on a banana leaf. So it's gonna be interesting. A new experience. We don't typically eat with our hands, so it'll be interesting. <laughs> and Ethan's gonna try it by his hands. Is it good? Taste it and let me know what it tastes like. You like it? Good? So he likes it. And I just decided to use a plate and a fork this time because I feel kind of self-conscious about it because I'm just not used to it. And uh, we have some water. We, we bought the bottle of water here. So, yeah. So we're going to eat it. Good girl, Alex. <laughs> we get to eat with our hands. <laughs> okay, now we're walking home. Okay, guys. 
So I just got done um, putting a few videos together and one's converting while we're gonna go eat dinner. We're gonna try to find like a cheap, ow, my legs hurt from the Doyce uh, stair things. Um, anyway, um, we're gonna go find a place to eat dinner. Hopefully a cheap place. Okay, so every restaurant we go to will not take our Visa card, our uh, debit card. So, the people who gave us uh, money, we had to use that for shampoo and toilet paper and water and stuff like that. So now, we have to go back to the um, Grand Hotel, who will take my um, bank card. It's an expensive place too. I'm really hoping, I'm really, really hoping that the bank situation gets cleared up ASAP because if not, we're gonna spend an arm and a leg just to eat here. Oh well. Okay, so we're here for dinner and Richie, Richie got his hot chocolate. Oh wait, is that yours? That was mine. I'm sorry, Alex got her hot chocolate. And they, they let them pour their own hot chocolate. Ethan's pouring his. Look at that. Isn't that cool, Ethan? <laughs> I can't so believe we're eating hot chocolate and how hot it is outside. Cup, we have another one. We have yeah. more. That's awesome. Yeah. In Thailand, they just give you a tiny cup and then expect you to pay. Yeah. That's cool, huh? Mm -hmm. How much is in there? No, the cup's worth. And Alex, and Alex and I are sharing a fish curry. I think it's enough for two people. We have like a little rice bread each. See this? I forgot what they call it. But um, then some fish curry. It's enough for two people totally. Hi huh, Alex. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna eat this. And then I got a milk a chocolate yes, shake. And then the boys are gonna share a club sandwich. Oh, it's and french fries. Okay, so what they did was they just halved it. See, that's totally big enough for both boys. We have to save money because of the bank situation. So we have to try to eat as cheap as we can. So. Is it good, Alex? Mm -hmm. So good. Do you like yours, Richie? We're not it yet. <laughs> it's the best. Good? Mm -hmm. Do you like it, Ethan? Yeah? I love you. Love you, Richie. Love you, Alex. <laughs> okay, so now we're done eating dinner and we are gonna walk home. And it's dark. <laughs> we were told not to walk at night. But we have no cash because of the ATM situation and because we had to, we bought waters, toilet paper, shampoo, soap, and all that stuff with um, the money that the, um, the people gave us, so. Um, we had to use our card for dinner and um, so now we don't have any cash for a tuk-tuk because the banks are closed <laughs> but um, it was a good dinner you know and so we're gonna walk home I'm just gonna close out this video I have to focus on walking there's like a lot of potholes on the ground like, a lot of like things I can trip over and stuff <laughs> Please like and subscribe and comment down below because we'd love to hear from you. But anyway, I'm gonna go. See you guys later. Bye.